More than two dozen dogs were rescued from deplorable conditions today by the Missouri Humane Society. 29 dogs were seized from a former breeder in Ozark County. Fox News Jordan Williams joins us now with the next steps for these animals. Jordan. Yeah, it was a dog breeder in Ozark County who had their license, their breeding license revoked, but they continued breeding anyway. The Missouri Department of Agriculture stepped in and passed the dogs off to the Humane Society of Missouri. And now 29 dogs will be looking for a new home. One by one, 29 the Lakeland Terriers rescued from a formerly licensed breeder in Ozark County. It was a good drive today. It was about a four and a half hour drive. The Humane Society of Missouri working with the Missouri Department of Agriculture in a 12 hour rescue mission bringing these dogs to the Humane Society Buddy Center in Maryland Heights. It's nice to know that the dogs will be bedded down somewhere warm. Yeah. Right a little bit behind me, you can see that they're getting examined by the vet. These 29 dogs are now looking for a new home, but it may take a little bit of time before they can be adopted. Once they realize that people are wonderful instead of scary, then they get to move forward and find a home. Veterinarian Julie Brinker spent about a couple hours examining the dogs Wednesday evening. Some dogs' rehab process may be a quick turnaround, while others could take a little longer. Some animals are going to be friendly and basically more healthy than others and might be able to have surgery in the next few days. Others may take a month or more to recover. It all varies. This one's missing an ear, another one has a, a big scar on the side of his face, and Another one has an abscess on his muzzle. So those are pretty, that's a lot of animals to be injured out of uh, only 30 animals, or 29 actually. Once the dogs make a full recovery, the Humane Society anticipates the tail wagging will continue as all dogs will eventually be adoptable. We're just excited to provide them a second chance at becoming a companion animal. Well, there's also no shortage of interest either. The Humane Society's Director of Communication tells me there's already been several inquiries about the dogs.